It's got a snake. Hello, hey. Hey. It's Nay. And welcome to my channel. So today I want to talk about some of the stuff I got for Christmas. Um, and I also stopped at Sephora with some of the money that I got for Christmas. So I wanted to show you guys what I got. So if you're interested in that, oh, excuse me, keep on watching. And we're just going to get right into it. So I didn't get a whole lot of stuff because I do have three kids. So my kids got nice stuff, which is great for me. I will not be buying any more toys for most of 2023. Okay, these kids get a lot of things, lots, lots of things, and of course diapers. I've ordered some diapers and stuff for them with some of the money I got. But I did get some stuff for myself because mommies matter too. Um, but before I tell you what I got from Sephora, which is a little few little things, I want to talk about what I did get. If you didn't see any of my previous videos, I did get so I recorded the video about things I wanted for the holidays. And then I got my birthday present, which is Parfum Somali's Delina Dry Body Oil. I think that was the first thing I had mentioned, or the second thing, something like that, um, that I had mentioned that I wanted to get. If you guys can't see already, I put a hefty freaking um, dent in this bottle. Um, here's the thing. When you get a new fragrance, right, you get really excited about it. You start, like, wearing it a lot, um, if you like it, of course. And I just quite like the Parfum Somali Delina's Dry Body Oil. I put some lotion on more times than not like a vanilla lotion and then I spray uh, and then I sp it's a spray like oh that did not okay it usually sprays better there you go it sprays like a really nice um spray and it smells so good and I smell myself for at minimum eight hours guys I smell myself for a very long time um when I spray this and this is like a hundred dollars or just under a hundred dollars um which is like mid price ish range um i do consider it like a fragrance okay i'm um, though it's a body oil technically um because it's very strong it's very strong and it smells really good and it can most definitely in my humble opinion replace the delina um parfum somali delina's actual fragrance of delina um just price wise right you gotta think price wise not everybody wants to spend the car payment money so this is a very very good alternative if you don't want to turn to any dupes um and you want it to be pretty much literally identical to the freaking um original fragrance so i've been loving this and i've been mixing this a lot actually nine times out of ten with um Kiali sweet diamond pink pepper and it gets me compliments every time it's actually intense um but it's just a really strong smell too so it's a really strong sweet rose based fragrance with some tart notes um like rhubarb and lychee and stuff like that but also the creaminess of Kiali sweet diamond pink pepper with that super vanilla it's just giving everything and the best best most healthiest most delicious bag of chips guys so yeah that's part from zamarli delina um and then i did say i want some samples some like little minis of other like a few different fragrances so i can try them out for you so this video will be coming soon as well so here's some mfk fragrances this is 724 gentle fluidity go uh gentle fluidity silver and aqua universalis cologne fort so i have tested these out um a little bit once and i will be recording a video probably in the same outfit um of me testing them out for you guys some more talking about what i think of them and would i actually go ahead and purchase one of these because come on um boom and then this was the top dog so i did get a sweater as well um it's probably i wore it the day i bought i got it because it was so cute it was like a like a print like a animal print really long sweater i'll probably end up wearing as a dress at some point with some like really cute tights or something and, and fat head boots um and so i got some cute earrings this is one of the earrings from the pack of earrings that i got yeah and that was that was and then cash so the biggest most awesome thing ever um for myself that i got was this right here i don't know if anybody watched the video but i really wanted the small version of the mfk 
OJ Gentle Fluidity <laughs> Y'all I feel so amazing so bougie there's a slight dent already in this bottle because i have sprayed it i have to say i'm just being honest here this is a heavy ass bottle the cap is freaking and i think the bottle here so the, the bottle's like chanel like um you know like longer and angel like so the bottle's just a nice like quality bottle but the cap is where it, it turns into some other ish this is a heavy ass cap this cap is giving weight it's giving heaviness um and so i got this and i am so freaking happy the goal is eventually to just start stacking up on these small versions of of mfk's products i love oud satin mood um and some uh, just a couple others but i do really love this i just feel really luxe it's giving moon prism power call me sailor i don't even know universal sailor universal like i'm just feeling even stronger than sailor moon herself stronger than queen her as queen serenity like i just feel like all of the things and all of the baddies and i probably can take all the dragon balls and keep coming back to life like goku dies 7342 times in the anime anyway i digress <laughs> i love this i'm loving it guys i i wore it and it lasts as long as Ocha's version, which is an extrait de parfum. This is, I'm fairly certain, just an eau de parfum. Yeah, this is an eau de parfum, and it it lasted all day. And when I say all day, I don't mean like oh five six hours. I mean like I put it on in the morning, and at nighttime you could smell me. Like I came home several hours later, and it was like still a strong smell. And the article of clothing I wore today still smells like this. So, um, is this something that once I finish it, am I gonna be like be continually restocking immediately? I'm not sure. The price, I feel like prices on this, um, and the Ocha version is fairly close. But I'm really, really, really glad I have this. I just. I don't need to wear this, I'm doing too much. Because today's scent of the day is Bruise and Vanilla from Duo, which is their dupe for Amika Lips Note to Vanilla. Oh my. I'm gonna try not to do too much with this fragrance, but I'm probably gonna wear it because I wear all my fragrances, even if the price tag is pricing, it is what it is. It's a fragrance, it's meant to be worn. Um, yeah i don't even know where to put her to be honest i just feel like she deserves like flowers around her and roses and, and sparkly stuff and... <laughs> all right so with some of the money i got for christmas i went and just made some small purchases i have so many fragrances guys i'm at the point where if i want a fragrance it's mostly due to like a like a one fluid ounce of a fragrance it's mostly due to the bottle because i've just been buying like you know like the roller balls and the like purse sprays of stuff and i think i'm just gonna keep doing that for the most things um i'm gonna just i have enough i have enough i have enough i have enough 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 so um i need to slow down i still feel like i spent buku money but i got just the purse sprays of stuff of things that i've been thinking about here we have the non-fragrance item this is the freck i've been wanting for too long to try out this freck old like um the og freck um freckle maker thing so it's this is just like i believe the mini of it i don't even know how it's going to work on my melanated skin um what do the directions say because i'm about to just start dotting on my face do, 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 do. Lightly apply a cluster of dots, dipping the brush off the log for me to sit and develop a to your skin tone. Copy and paste your freckles by tapping them across your face. Okay, let's just do this together, okay? I 
feel like I have to do like a nose strip thingy to like because my nose I just feel like has some big pores lately but perhaps I'm being extra but I do like freckles I mean I've kind of always liked freckles literally my whole life um it's hilarious because I do remember when freckles wasn't a cool thing um, and now people are putting fake freckles on their face we'll see how that goes if it doesn't look cute on me I'll give it to my little sister she's of a lighter complexion than I am but And then I got this sweet this little kit for under $20. And then this little lash rocket mascara it has lash enhancing like peptides in it. So we'll see. If it does anything. And I'm not about to sit here right now doing too much with this mascara, but oh, not me putting it on my nose. That's one thing that I got just because it was on sale. And I was like, I've been wanting to try to test it out. We're gonna see how it develops color-wise. Right now, right now it looks eh, the color's not the most flattering on me. But we'll see. I don't really intend to leave my house again. And then I got two fragrances um for sprays. So I got this. This is Flor Flower Bomb Nectar. I actually did get like six fragrances this Christmas um, so I am six I think six fragrances of lighter um, but here is flower bombs nectar and um, I actually do like the bottle of this but I'm not a hundred percent on the fragrance like I'm about a solid 85 because I feel like I like the smell of it but I do I like the smell of it enough that I feel like I'm going to actually wear it I, that is the question Oh, this smells so good. Okay, so let me tell you why I feel like, am I going to actually wear this? This definitely smells to me like a super, it's a floral fragrance for me. For Like, here's my thing. It's a sweet floral fragrance to me. I'm not sure of the exact notes, but it's a sweet floral fragrance that's a little, it almost something in it gives me some type of vibe to like scan, the OG Scandal by JPG. Um, and I like it. However, like I could wear flower bomb nectar in the day, and then if I'm going out at nighttime, layer it with scandal, and I think I would smell phenomenal. There's something in them that is just giving similar vibes. Um, whereas scandal can get it gets a little deeper and thicker, but this is this is just a really lovely one. I just want to make sure. So I have favorites, and I feel like when you start um, racking up. I mean, there's definitely people in the fr the fry community who have significantly more than I do, but I definitely have a lot compared to the average consumer because I have a bunch of fragrances here and then fragrances over there, and I just it's just a lot of fragrances, and then I have my monthly tray of fragrances right here. It's just a lot of fragrance my up, and so I like all of my fragrances. Truth be told, in every which some type of way, even the ones that I said I have hates for that I have in my collection, I like in some aspect. However, there's just not enough days in the year, especially because you're gonna probably have some days where you just don't feel like wearing fragrance, um, whether because you're not leaving your house or you put on lotion and you lay a lotion with that body aisle and you have aisle and lotion and you just a smell, 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 and so you're like, I don't really need to spray right now. And so you just don't wanna smell like anything strong, okay? Um, which also comes into play, I feel like I'm leaning towards some fresh scents as well. Because I was looking at that Missing Persons fragrance. I like that Missing Persons fragrance. And I didn't grab it yesterday, and now I feel like tomorrow I have to go back. They had like a $26 
little sampler pack and then you get a free travel spray not free you pay for the travel spray um and um they just didn't have it in store so you know my impatient behind was like so um yeah that that happened um so i didn't get it but that's fine i can always go back another time but i do like this i like this a lot and we're gonna keep we're gonna test it out we're gonna see how i feel and i'll um let y'all know i'll probably include this with the other video um because we'll go into notes and stuff for each of the fragrances but yeah so that's flower bomb nectar i did see a flower bomb and a rise of right now i do not like the newest I think it's the newest but they're all um what is it called good fortune i don't like it um it's not for me right now the smell kind of actually made me a little nauseous so as of right now i don't need it but i did see that little pack that one that was really cute the next thing i did get was the infamous born in roma the og valentino born in roma i'm not gonna even hold you i like the travel sprays they're different than every other basic ass travel spray because they first of all they made it spiky. So obviously, as we all know, the the Born in Roma bottles all are very unique. They look like this one. So then I've despite them. Um, so they made the travel sprays. This is Valentino Donna Bor Donna Born in Roma Yellow Dreams. I was like, what is the name of this? I actually love this fragrance as well. It's just a lemony, musky, fiery, very feminine. Delicious, delicious. Um, but not in the good way. Right? Delicious in the feminine, like attractive type of way. This now, what is super cool is I believe this is not the actual bottle. This is a casing, um, which I think is freaking fantabulous. I'm not, should I even try? Yeah, there we go. The bottom is open, so you can literally push it out, and in it, it this is just holding a regular bottle like Prada Paradox. But they were cool enough to slide it into this cool casing, so it looks like I just think this is really fantabulous, and I think this is adorable. But boom, and I like this. Um, I did say I did think I mentioned that I was gonna eventually end up getting this because I don't have not one test that should yo mm -mm, I am slugging oh my god I'm gonna really break stuff in there because that would be atrocities okay. I just want to spray on something and I'll spray on this this is just a very gourmandy actually that is gourmandies I remember like it's giving like I'm just gonna spray it with my hand it's not being extra it's a little bright it's definitely still sweet um oh wow this is a this smells really good it's I think if you're gonna gift anything for any any point like fragrance wise um, whether it be this travel spray that was $32 or the bigger bottle or whatever this would probably appease most people uh, most women as long as they don't mind that their fragrance is strong right if they're like one of those fresher scents this is most definitely not it it definitely is a bright strong ass fragrance it's sweet as well and as it dries down it gets a little sweeter I'm not sure what floor is on here but I'm kind of smelling that um as well it smells really good you gotta be careful because right now i'm just blooming in my face but i did spray a couple frag different fragrances right now it's delicious it's beautiful it's girly it's feminine it's womanly at the same time because she's really strong she's really strong she's she's got kick to her um so i just felt like you know i'm just gonna add it to my collection i don't think i'm i'm not sure if i'll ever get a like a regular size bottle of it but this definitely will work for me for now so I'm not liking how this is looking on my nose right now. So maybe I'll just put it on my face because my face kind of looks cute. But yeah, that's Valentino's Donna Born in Roma. 
and that was all I got. Basically, those were my gifts. Yeah. Oh, anyway, excuse me. Thank you so much for watching this whole video. Um, let me know if you got any fragrances, any testers, any um, to, like travel sprays of any fragrances. Because I am definitely interested in that one as well. Um, and what you got for the holidays? Did you get anything you wanted to get? Because um, I know, you know, it's in the corner of right now. You know what I mean? So take your time while building collections of anything. Um, just so it's not a bigger hit. Like a huge hit to your pockets them then you have to pay your bills them first all right um but yeah drop me in the comment section as well um some type of flowers can you drop me some flowers let me know you reached the end of this video and hopefully i'll see you in my next one bye bye